Hi, we're going to talk about the importance of calcium in your vegetable patch, particularly as it relates to the nightshade family. That's tomatoes, potatoes, peppers, eggplants, tomatillos, those sorts of things. If you've ever noticed a black patch on the bottom of your tomatoes, that's blossom end rot. And that's caused by a lack of calcium or by insufficient calcium being uptaken into the plant tissue. So um, we add calcium at the beginning of the planting cycle. We don't even leave it to chance. We do that by adding GNB bone meal to the bottom of our planting holes. We add about a half a cup per tomato plant. We dig a two foot deep hole, we add the bone meal to it, plus a bunch of other things, and we'll talk about what those are in another video, but bone meal is particularly important, not only for the calcium, but for the potassium that it has. Potassium means more flowers and root formation. That's all good stuff when we're talking tomatoes. More flowers, more fruit. Uh, the other thing that you need to be aware of is that when you let your tomatoes dry out too much, particularly when growing in a pot, that takes away the calcium from the plant and they need a constant supply of it. So when you're growing in a pot or a container, make sure that pot or container does not dry out. We wanna give the tomato consistent water because it uptakes the water into its vascular system from the ground level and put, pushes it all the way to the bottom of the tomato. Elongated tomatoes, the ones that are skinny, skinny and long, you'll notice that they have more of a tendency to have blossom end rot because it's that calcium trying to get down to the tip here that is having a problem. So two tips, put bone meal on the bottom of your planting hole at the beginning of the season and don't let them dry out too much. Okay guys, that's all about the importance of calcium. Thanks.